Hey everybody, Mr. Claw Guitar, Lesson 76. Today we're going to do an A minor 7 to a B minor 7 flat 5 to an E7 sharp 9 to an E9 or E7 flat 9 and then back. I know this sounds uh, really complicated, but it's not. And uh, an A minor seven, if uh, you don't already know, is on the fifth position. You know, uh, okay. Let's make that real simple. Take the first finger, just lay it across the fifth fret. Take the uh, third finger, put it on the seventh fret of the A string. There's your minor seventh. Now, for the uh, B minor flat 5, B minor 7 flat 5, we make an A minor shape using the uh, first finger on the 6th fret of the B string. The pinky will be on the 7th fret of the G string. And the third finger will be on the 7th fret of the D string. And the middle finger will be all the way up here on the 7th fret of the E string, low E string. Okay. And that will set up this E7, sharp 9. You know, the Jimi Hendrix chord, he made that real popular. And the E7 flat 9. Okay. Now for that one, what you're really going to need to do is, is on the 6th fret, you're going to cover these three strings. Okay, and we'll be using the note, the G sharp on the 6th uh, uh, fret, and the F on the 6th fret. Okay, so you know what we're doing. So, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. Now my students, they, 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 for some reason, they just don't like doing it this way. All right? There's a lot of cats out there, you know, they're not classically studied. They just want to play, okay? So what they'll do is, instead of this, okay, they use the thumb. If your hand is big enough, you can take the thumb, you put it right there, and just flatten out from the D string down to the E string. First, uh, first finger. This is the easy way to do it. Now why is it easy when we go to this B minor? If you notice, I've got an A minor shape. I just slide that up to the sixth position and just add the thumb. And you sound like you're playing some really cool jazz stuff and the Jimi Hendrix chord. Raise the pinky. So, one. Now you're sounding like Carlos Santana. And by adding that pinky, you turn this into a nine chord. A minor nine. And to solo over that, all we need to do really is uh, an A natural minor. Or just a plain old minor pentatonic.
Sounds cool, doesn't it? Okay, have fun with this one, folks, and I'll talk to you later.